Hey guys, Grady's mom here with my second haul of the day. Um, it's nighttime now, and um, I just ran out to Walmart because I had just a moment of opportunity um, to do that. So I'm just trying to compile things, um, probably in like three to four shopping trips, two of which I made today, one to Target, one to Walmart. Um, and again, just went to Walmart, and this is what I got. I got these two, they're like uh, tall, I think they're like six to eight inches. Um, they're the LED candles, flameless candles for another piece of decor that I have in my bedroom um, that my husband suggested getting the flameless because then we don't have to worry about, you know, fires and flames and all that stuff. Um, so I also, so that's what I got these for. Um, I got some organic spring mix to make salads this week. Um, some of the IBC cream soda, some Cheez-Its, some Doritos, um, some matchstick carrots for my salads this week. I got a few of the steam fresh veggies. These were a dollar. I always think they're a good deal at Walmart. So I got peas and then I got two of the mixed veggies. I got some sharp cheddar because I'm going to make some mac and cheese this week. I got the variety pack um, of the Magic Clean Mr. Erasers. So it has two kitchen, two bath, and then two of the extra power. Um, I got these three little organizational bins for my junk drawer in my kitchen. I think these were like 97 cents for all three, I think. Um, so I thought those were a great steal for a junk drawer. I just got um, a package of printer paper. We're almost out of that. I got one banana. I usually buy like one or two bananas at a time, so I just grabbed one. I got a couple of tomatoes on the vine, a red onion. I got a three-pound bag of just the yellow or white cooking onions. I got um, this gelato, this coffee chocolate chip. I love this brand. I usually get it at Target, but it's um, more expensive at Target, so I just got it from Walmart. It's just a pint. I got some sandwich bags. I got two sizes of tissues, the small box-shaped tissues, and then I got um, another package of the um, larger box tissues. And then I got some breakfast sandwiches for my husband's lunch, or excuse me, for my husband's breakfast in the morning for work. Um, some Snapple apple drink, some Mott's applesauce. I got a backup ketchup. Um, the one we have now in the fridge is like half full or half empty, so I got a backup. Um, I got my favorite salsa, which is the Newman's medium pineapple salsa. I just got a jar of Prego meats, uh, marinara meat sauce that I can use for recipes. I got some smoothies for Grady. And I also got some things that I have on the floor here because they were too big for the counter. I just got two um, just regular standard pillows, nothing spectacular, just for the guest bedroom bed because it doesn't have any pillows right now, so I got that. Um, I actually got this mop for my hardwood floors. Um, usually for floors that aren't carpet, I would Swiffer, but I've read and heard a lot of people say that um, the Swiffer actually dulls the shine and the finish on your wood floor, so this got really good reviews. <clears throat> it's the Bona Hardwood Floor Mop. Um, so you just have to buy the refill and then the cloth pad is actually machine washable So I thought that was pretty cool because you don't have to keep buying the refill pads like you do with the Swiffers I got a big box of the Apple and Eve organic um, juices because my son will be starting preschool um, In just a few weeks, so I just wanted to have this um, It's just a variety pack to pack in his lunch for preschool and then the last thing I got is a really cool um it's one of those gel it's it looks like leather guys like weaved leather it's actually really it's sort of really high-end looking um i was actually really surprised to see it in walmart i'm trying to give you guys a good view um i know the main one of these that all of the other ones try to copy i guess are sold at bed bath and beyond i forgot the name but it's the same exact concept at bed bath and beyond but like three times the price this was around $30. Um, it's fairly large, actually. My island is really big, and this is fairly large, um, so I feel like it's just really good for me to have since I cook, you know, I'm in the kitchen all the time. Um, so I got this for here. I was going to get the one at Bed Bath & Beyond, but, I mean, for three times the price, I figured I would give this a shot. Um, it was under $30. And I'm just going to give it a shot, see how it works out. It feels it felt extremely comfortable on my feet in the store. So I just thought it was really, really nice. So I think that is everything I got at Walmart right here. And then again, just a few things on the floor. 
and the kitchen is coming along really nice. Give you guys a little sneak peek. My husband put the cabinet hardware on. So, as you can see, all the cabinets now have the hardware on them. The one above the fridge. The island has it. I think it's all on there. Yeah, it's all. He's finished. So, I think it looks really good. So, I hope you guys enjoyed my second haul of the day. I'm probably going to be doing another haul within the next couple days where I have to get all my meat. Um, so that'll be a more expensive haul, but I have to do it because I just want to stock everything up so I can start cooking tons and tons of things from scratch. I hope you guys all have a great day, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye!